Hey, what's up you guys? If you're planning on towing a trailer with your Toyota Sienna, you have to have trailer wiring installed. It's required by the law. Let's go ahead and break down that install. You'll need the tools seen here to complete this installation. So to start, our trailer wiring is going to plug into our vehicle's taillights. So we're going to start by removing each of our taillights. We're going to start on the passenger side. Each taillight is held in by two bolts and we're going to remove those using a 10 millimeter socket. Next, to remove the tail light, we're going to pull outward on it. Now there's two pins on it located here and here. Now sometimes they can be kind of tight, so we're going to take a trim panel tool and we can just stick it in between the tail light and the fascia and we can help pry it out. And as you can see, we have those two pins right there. Now we're just going to unplug our tail light harness. We're going to push down on this tab right here and then just pull out. And we'll set this aside. And then we'll repeat on the driver's side. Next, we're going to remove the rear threshold panel in our cargo area. It's held in by three cargo hooks. And we're going to remove those by first taking off the cap with a flathead screwdriver. and that exposes a screw, which we'll remove using a 10 millimeter socket. Then we'll use a screwdriver to pry the hook off. And then to remove the rear threshold panel, we're just gonna pull up on it. Next on the driver's side, we're going to pull back on our paneling right here. There's two pins, one located here and here. We're just going to pull back on it using a trim panel tool. And this gives us access to our wiring harness, which is right here. Now on the passenger side, we're going to remove this jack storage door. I'm just going to turn these and then just pull it out. Now we're gonna take our T connector with the green and red wire, and we're gonna bring it through this opening and up through our tail light. Now we're gonna take our T connector and we're gonna plug it into our vehicle's passenger tail light harness. And now using the other side of our T connector, we're going to reinstall our passenger side tail light. Now we're going to take our yellow T connector and our white ground wire and we're going to route it outside of our paneling. We're just going to pull back on it right here and then we're going to take these two wires and towards the bottom of the paneling we're just going to pull it through. Now we're going to take our white wire with the ring terminal and we're going to ground it to the metal underneath our rear threshold panel. We're just going to go right here. We're going to use the provided self-tapping screw and a quarter inch socket. Now we're going to take our yellow T connector and on the driver's side, we're going to pull it behind our paneling out through our taillight opening. And now we'll go ahead and plug in our T connector to our taillight harness. And then we'll go ahead and reinstall our taillight. And now we're going to go ahead and reinstall our driver's side paneling. So with our wiring plugged in and installed, let's go ahead and talk about where you can store your four flat harness on your Toyota Sienna. Now if you want, you can just leave it right here in this jack compartment and then pull it out through the weather seal when you need to use it. Or you can bring it underneath your vehicle and mount it next to your hitch receiver. Let's go ahead and show you how to do that. We're going to take our four flat harness and we're going to route it to the outside of this paneling. And then we're going to pull up on the carpet right here and that gives us access to this grommet right here. We're going to go ahead and remove it and that 
Right here is the hitch cross tube. And then we're gonna take our four flat harness, we're gonna push it over the cross tube of the hitch towards the rear of the vehicle. Now we're gonna take our grommet and we're gonna cut a slit halfway through for our wire to sit in. So we're gonna take our wire, we're gonna set it into that slit and then we'll reinstall our grommet. Then to seal that slit, we're going to use some black silicone. All right, with our four flat underneath our vehicle, let's go ahead and put together all of our cargo area. Now back underneath our vehicle with our four flat harness, if you leave it dangling on your hitch, you risk it dragging on the ground and getting damaged. So we're going to secure it using a four flat mounting bracket. This is not included with our kit, but you can pick it up at your closest U-Haul store or at uhaul.com. We're just gonna line it up on the bumper right here. And then using a drill bit, we're gonna drill our first hole. Then we'll bring our first screw into place. And then we'll line it up and secure it with the provided nut. And we're gonna get it nice and square and we'll repeat on the second hole. And then we'll tighten it with a 10 millimeter socket. With your wiring powered up and secured, you're ready to tow a trailer. Thank you for watching our video. If you have any questions about this product, or if you'd like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul Hitch Professional, you can visit your closest U-Haul Hitch Center, or you can visit us online at uhaulhitches.com. Thank you.